Hello, this is uh, Shankar and uh, uh, today I'll make a small uh, video on, you know, I was doing a series on my own experience in astrology with respect to various planets and uh, I would like you to see it and let me know about it. And what I would say whenever Saturn is, this is about Saturn today. Saturn, I talked about Jupiter, I'll talk more about Jupiter. Whenever Saturn is in the fourth house, I've seen that the people who prosper are those who drink, who are tamasic, who eat non-vegetarian food, and uh, those are the people who do very well in life. I've seen people having Saturn in fourth when they have, they're vegetarians, they are not uh, drinking, etc. They're not doing very well in life. And as soon as they start doing these things, they start doing very well in life. They start progressing in their profession. I don't know, but this is what is there. When Saturn is the fourth, it has a logic behind it, which uh, I would explain someday. But Saturn in the fourth uh, would, uh, would, I mean, it's, it's, it's not a right thing to say, but Saturn in fourth, uh, people who start drinking, start taking non veg etc., they start doing very well in life. Another important thing is Saturn in the fifth house. Saturn in the fifth house uh, restricts the number of uh, uh, male children. Male children could be an uh, issue. I mean, uh, I, it's not that every time it's an issue because I'm talking about whenever Saturn is alone in the fifth house. It does create, uh, it does uh, create, uh, it does create kind of, uh, uh, kind of progeny issues especially having a male progeny issues. This is astrological. It has got nothing to do with uh, any other thing. And uh, so this is what I've observed. Uh, also, when uh, Saturn is in uh, fifth house, I've also seen that uh, uh, the, uh, the relationships uh, are not good uh, with their children. I mean, relationships are not very good with the children. And especially if all the seventh in, is in fifth, it gives a tendency of having uh, relationships which are not uh, correct. That is, uh, extramarital relationships. Uh, Saturn, uh, generally, when is there, I like to repeat, it's, it's, it, it, you will have relationship with children will, uh, will, will not be good. This is when Saturn alone is in the fifth house. I've already talked about Saturn when it is in fourth house. These are two things which I have seen in innumerable horoscopes. And uh, also when uh, Saturn is in fourth house, I've seen that people who have tried to make houses from the ground, they have not prospered. I mean, you, you, you stay in an apartment, you stay in a floor, it's very good. You can have a lavish floor. But if on your own name, you want to make a house, which is on the earth, I mean, you raise it from the ground and make it, it always leads, to, it has always led to a downfall of that person after he, he has, he or she has done so. This is one more observation I've seen in innumerable horoscopes I've seen. And uh, it's time to tell people, you guys also have a look at it and let me know. It is, I'm talking only when Saturn is alone in the fourth house and when Saturn alone is in the fifth house. When there are other planets, things do get colored. So this was uh, my small video, which was on Saturn and my observation on Saturn. Uh, this is Shankar Laval signing out. Uh, this is my hobby and research. It has nothing to do with, I'm not a professional. Uh, you can always write to me at connectingminds at gmail.com. You can go to my site. You can hear my podcast. And uh, I mean, uh, you would, I'm sure, I'm sure you would write your comments uh, of those who observed this or vice versa also. Thanks. Bye for now.